In Bodrum, one of the oldest cities in the world, life has continued in the same location for thousands of years. The ruins of the ancient town are encountered in every corner of the city. In addition, numerous mosaics dating to the late Roman age, the second golden age of the city, were discovered during scientific excavations and by chance. At Mindo's Gate area, 17 noble tombs, which date to the 4th and 5th centuries AD, have mosaics with animal and geometric motifs. The tombs have been exposed to robberies since ancient times and partly destroyed during these illegal digs. These mosaics excavated by Charles Newton in the 19th century depicted vine leaves, birds eating grapes, objects of the Dionysus cult, and panels with geometric motifs. During the 19th century, English archaeologist Newton, trying to find mausoleum, discovered an amazing late Roman villa and reached numerous mosaics. These mosaics depicted mainly scenes such as Atlanta and Maligar hunting, female figures representing Alexandria, Halicarnassos, and Beirut, and the figures of Europa and the Bull. Dionysus and goddess Aphrodite, carried by Tritons. The Charidemos house, which dates back to the 5th century AD, covers approximately 1400 square meters. During the period 1990 to 1993, a late Roman villa with four large floor mosaics was excavated. In the second year of the excavation, it was discovered that it was part of the Roman villa excavated and published by Charles Newton in the 19th century. Danish and Turkish archaeologists cleaned the mosaics during the excavations, took pictures, and then covered them again for protection. Among the mosaics found here, there was a dedicatory inscription, a figure representing spring, and a representation of a Nereid riding on a sea centaur playing the Scythara. During the construction of an annex building of the Bodrum American Hospital, the workers encountered a Roman building with fine mosaics. Koch Business Group decided to preserve these late Roman period mosaics and displayed them in six glass pools. On the floor of the first section, visitors enjoy the scenes depicting two facing dolphins, a sheep with a cypress tree, a wreath decorated with laurel leaves, and a duck figure in the bowl. Great mosaic panels include, vine branches, stylized grape bunches, birds eating food from a bow, a scene showing a leopard attacking a mountain goat. This skillfully made mosaic, where land, sea animals, and birds are depicted together, covers 80 square meters. Visitors can admire unique scenes depicting storks, ducks, snakes, octopus, fish, crab images, 
a jumping deer, a mountain goat, and reused ancient stadium seats. The floor mosaics and walls date to remains belonging to the late Roman period, AD 400-500.